Greetings everybody with Prime Games Online. Welcome back to more Persona Q Shadow of the Labyrinth. In the last episode, we worked our way to the end of the Group Date Cafe. And this episode, let's go on a few strolls to start off with. Sensing a Guardian, we'll start with this one. Hey. What's going on? Up ahead. It wouldn't make sense. Hmm. <laughs> My goodness. So it'll be something to do with group dates, maybe? Something like that, I'd say. I agree, though. This is getting exciting now. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, um, um. Yep. That was enjoyable. Next, we have a real drag. What? Huh? What the? Yeah, you would be... you would be surprised what happened. Well, that's a start as to what happened. What? <sighs> what? For real? Of course, you would find that part great, Yosuke. Junpei, you just want to cross dressing pageant so that way history can repeat itself. Jeez. <laughs> oh. Yeah, technically Teddy, Teddy wasn't a high school student either. Huh? Leave it to me. Why not? Maybe not as a hey! maybe not as a guest contestant. Maybe just a watch. <laughs> Junpei. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Checkmate, Yukari. And lastly, who's the poet? If it won't take long, sure. Oh. Hmm, <gasps> not quite, Elizabeth. Honestly. Of course, Marie says it's dead on. I 
When someone talks about food, Chie just loses it. Of course not. Uh, she's always excitable when it comes to food. <sighs> That's true. Naoto did have to recite the poem. Alright, now that's done. Next thing we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna get done with the rest of the quests. Welcome. Let's go ahead and we'll start with legendary medicine. This quest is Skin. That's what we need to keep our eyes out. Maybe good for you to hear what Theo has to say. Could this be? Yes, I took some time to go get a snake skin because so the snake skin. In order to find it, they are dropped by the snakes in the group date cafe. Though the catch is, they need to have the they need to have the agility debuff, not like the Secunda agility debuff. Buff, but you need to use a move like, say, for example, Scarecrow, which Ukabot knows, so I just bought, my, bought back Ukabot, and uh, there you go. So we'll go ahead and report that request. Thank you very much. Then. This will be your reward. We get a promotion ticket. That is actually pretty handy because what it does is it'll give us a 10% discount off of shops. And Mature is learning Tentarufu. Or Tentaru. Tentarufu? I don't know. Which. It beats Marn Car, and anyone who's played Persona 3 gets that joke. Anyways, let's go ahead and see what else we have. Uh, let's do obtain a love potion next. This quest is. Even with that said. What? Of course, Tay is the first to know about this. Where? Oh. I've got something on my radar. Does have a time limit, so we should probably get this done. We better get to hunting then. You might have also noticed that I actually did readjust my party a bit. Let's go ahead and Teddy in replacement of. We'll put you in replacement of Yukari for now. Let's head into the group date cafe. See if we can find a love potion. 
I'm not sure on what floor will be on. That's the problem. But I imagine we're going to get a heads up when we're on the right floor. So we'll start there. Uh... Alright, it's not on this floor. Good to know. Well then, let's go ahead and make our way to the next floor. Oops, I got to I've got to find my way through a few enemies first. You know what? Why not? I'll fight let's these guys. Plus, I can show off a bit. Plus, I can show off Teddy and what he can do. Besides, just be a complete idiot. Mamudo? Yes. So we'll go ahead and use Mabufu. The Teddy. And we'll see where this gets us. We do have the we do have the advantage. Well it's possible we might even be get the shot what Teddy can do. This Bufu will finish it off. Sorry Teddy, you get the shaft. Everyone is used in that battle but Teddy. Oh, at least he gets some decent experience. And I did not equip this up persona to him. That might have been smart, but oh well. Not like I'm gonna have him for long. Okay, might it be on this floor? Nope. Let's move on to the next floor then. This way. Unfortunately, did not take us that long. Alright, is it on this floor? Uh, uh, he's picking up something. My nose knows. Let's see here. It's coming from the west. It would also probably be easier if I had this in a one, fixed. Alright, where would that love potion be then? Hmm. Coming from the east, okay. Also, I'm gonna run into an enemy soon. No. Hi, enemy. I'm just gonna run. I'm not gonna waste my time. Alright, let's keep looking. Let's see here. Okay, you keep saying to the east. Maybe I should have. Maybe I should just do that. Coming from the west, or you said east, so that would be uh, There's a power spot. this way. I also have a power spot here, so I might as well grab some items. Now you are making no sense when it comes to my search for this thing. Let's begin, Senpai. I'm ready. Let's not start with a failing to escape now. Alright, good. Hmm. We're to go east more. This is gonna be very confusing, but you know what? We'll get there eventually. Let's see. It's an enemy FOE. Stay on your guard. Maybe it's in the area just okay, I think I might have an idea of where that potion is. They are right below where we are. Thank you, enemy, for interrupting me. I'm getting out of here. Threat level is low. It may look angelic, 
but it's truly vicious. I think it's in the area just below us. That's the most likely candidate for where it would be. And there is a... Hmm. From the east, I know. So it might be in this area. Shall we go then? It's an enemy FOE. Stay on your guard. Watch out! <sighs> Damn FOEs. Always complicating matters. Here I come! There are three shadows. You Getting out of here me. once again. So it looks like we can get, gotta go further south. And we'll go this way. And that's a, just a dead end. Okay, well I think I know where we need to go. Okay, I think I see a way there now. Which will hopefully not take too long. It won't take that long if I don't keep running into enemies, that is. I could find and get a bit of extra experience, but really, they're not really worth my time. And I'll probably just do a lot of level training off screen. Okay, I think the best way to get there would be go this way. So much to the south. We'll go through here then. Another enemy. What do we have? There Just run. Three shadows. Let's give it our best, Sensei. Yeah, I'm counting on you. Easy. Oh Jesus. Yeah. No. We get out of here. We need to get out of here. All right. Back to searching. Teddy, your health is pretty low. Be careful. Here I come! Might be in this area. Woo! So we'll probably be in this area and go up a bit. There's oh, hello, you are an by. FOE. Be very careful! I want to fight these guys. I will defeat it. It's not every day you get to fight these guys. It would be nice if I still had my scarecrow move with me so I could pre prevent their movement. But, oh well. Let's just try to beat the crap out of them. Alright, well, there goes one of them. I'm already satisfied, assuming I can get out of this battle alive. Impossible. Oh, well, there goes my boost, but that's not the worst thing. I don't like, those that Megado is a thing. And it's used against me. Because I hate Megado when it's used against me. I like using Megado, I just hate when it's used against me. Okay, looks like this one's about to go down. Hopefully one of the twin slashes hits. Yes. Oh, pointless people. All right, well, that was still pretty good. They escaped. It would have been nice to give Teddy some experience, but oh well. Gold hands are gold hands, and, I, Senpai, and gold okay? hands do give me Somebody a lot of experience. All right, Teddy. Where do we need to go from here, Teddy? I should... Woo! So that means here? That's the FOE. It might be here. Please stay this on your place guard. looks suspect. Here it is. 
Good job. Huh? Hey, what's going on? Uh-huh. Hey. But what? Man, oh man. Don't you drink it, bear. <laughs> it's bear time! W wait, hold on. Uh, how should I put this? Hey. Teddy, I'm gonna kill you. Oh no! What? Hey. Evidently. Don't be ridiculous. What? No. Come on! Let's get out of here. Let's go turn that request as much of a roller coaster as that was. I also need healing, so heal me, please, Elizabeth. I love potion complete. I see. <laughs> This will be your reward. And a track pipe. I'll have to see what that does in a little bit. For now, we get more experience. <laughs> I'm growing too, you know. Oh, and Junpei's wearing Death Chaser. I have become stronger once And I guess is wearing Body Shield. <laughs> and Ken's wearing Siunga. <laughs> We're just learning stuff all around. Okay, that was pretty nice. Next, let's go to request from Mr. X. Are you? This quest is. Well. Gee, I wonder who this person is. Does have a time limit, so we're gonna stroll later. For now, let's also check what that item that we have does. Let's see here. A track pipe. Greatly raises encounter rate in labyrinths. Well, if I'm trying to get some experience, that might be all right, but generally on camera, that's not the most ideal thing. Anyways, picking up girls. need to basically attack their interests in terms of what we say. Let's get this over with. What's that? Um, hey. Huh? Mm -mm, I'm not sure. Who is this, Mr. X? A Kung Fu buff. What? 
don't think, feel, right? Bye! What the? Look at this! <laughs> He's a comedian. <laughs> Thanks. Every sec. Senpai. I have not seen him anywhere. Okay. Come on. Are you sure? Mm. He's a master of love. How are you? Hi, Naoto. Still no luck? <sighs> this looks suspicious. That person is he? Well, you'll find out at the food court. I'll see you later. As I suspected. I thought as much. For reals? I, I mean, you know... Here I come! Ta-da! So, what do you think? It's brilliant. <laughs> I think this is mostly for your morale, Junpei. Not gonna lie on this. Hey! Uh huh. Oh, come on, how does that even make sense? Mm hmm. Huh? <laughs> what the? Looks like I put Junpei in a sticky situation. Uh, whoops, my bad. What? <laughs> my bad. Yeah! Hey now. Nothing much. <sighs> so. Hmm. Yep. Yep. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> mm hmm. Um... Wait!
straight up! Huh? Yep, yep. That's a pity. Take care. It's like Junpei's perfect plan is falling apart. I, I mean, you know, I got a bad feeling here. Hey, man. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, okay. Whew. Hey. Come on. Um. <sighs> Whoops. <laughs> Really? Take care. Hey now. You okay? I hope there's an next one to see your perfect plan fall even more apart, Junpei. As if it hasn't already fallen apart. Yo! You're such a... <laughs> You're the one behind this. Uh... Oh, Junpei, I thought your plan couldn't fall apart anymore, but... We should probably head back. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was a thing. Let's go ahead and report this quest then. Welcome. Wait a moment. I apologize for the wait. Uh, here, you can have it. We get the energy luck reserve or reverse. Damn, that's amazing. Excuse me. And because we got all four girls, we also got a skill card from Medea and a Snestle. in your hands, man. Alright, think this one through, Junpei. <laughs> Not bad at all. You is learning Dekunda. Like Next, investigate you in Wonderland. Like Thank you for accepting. It seems as though. Alright. Let's get down to business then. First, I'm gonna switch Teddy out for... I think I let Yukari set up. Basically, here's how my team is designed, by the way. Also, that's not where I changed my party around. Basically, Yukiko and Yukari are healers. Yukiko is primary, uh, Yukari is secondary. Naoto is there to use a bunch of physical attacks, and whenever a boost is in effect, use Megadola. Yu is here for electric attacks because this person, this boss we're fighting, will be weak to electric because I actually did a practice run of this guy. And then we just have our leader. Now, in case this does not go according to plan, let's make a backup save. Because backup saves are always nice to have. And let's go to you in Wonderland. Remember that beetle that we found on the last floor? Now we're ready to fight it.
Let's do this. Hi, right, buddy. Let's bow. One enemy. I don't have any data on that coming. All right. We that? have the golden beetle. Let's open up with a healing breeze. And that thing is for turning weak to Zio. I do have Zio at my disposal, but I'm gonna open up with a Chirunda. Because this thing does have a decent amount of attack. Next, you, you can use Yonga. Yukiko? Uh, you can just guard. Naoto, you use Twin Slash, we might be able to get a critical. And Yukari, you can also just guard. Alright, let's begin by lowering this thing's attack, because he does get two attacks per turn, so that is one thing to be cautious of. Twin, twin Slash, we're getting a critical hit right off the bat. We'll go ahead and hit with its weakness. After all, attack is weak point for massive damage. Also, thank god that missed, though, as that was suck. Unfortunately, you took a pretty hard hit, yet. I would also like to point out how much damage he did, and considering the fact that I already put up a Chirunda on this guy. That's a decent amount of damage, I, let, let's just say that. Uh, do I want, no. Uh, actually... Yeah, I'm gonna use Diorama on you, just in case. Now tell you can use Megado, and Yukari you can just guard. Two hundred sixteen damage. That's pretty good. Then we'll strike you with your weakness. Ow! All right. Good thing you missed you. So now I'm gonna have you use your power charge. That's gonna cost nothing. I'm also going to use the, lay down our healing breeze and increase the length of Tarunda. You, you go and use power charge. Yukiko, you heal myself. Naoto, you use twin slash. Kari, you can just guard again. Our charge, take advantage of our boost that we had. Alright, let's go ahead and increase the duration of Tarunda. Twin Slash, no critical, but that would have been that would have been ideal, but unfortunately it did not happen. Alright, we're back on track. We'll go and use Zeo. We'll use Raizok, Raikozan. Ikari, you can just guard. Naoto, Twin Slash, and Yukari, you just guard. And this time, Twin Slash will get a critical. Nope. Rikozan does massive damage. Also, there goes my boost. Oh, that's, that's not what I wanted to happen. That's how you use Zio, or Zio rather, or Zokan, no not the vet. Yukiko, you use Diorama, Naoto you use Twin Slash, and Yukari, you use Medea. Ooh, another critical. Naoto can keep that boost going, we'll go and use Megado next turn. Oh, well, there goes use boost. Unfortunately, but hey, what are you gonna do? Okay, you just barely survived, which is why we're using Diorama on him. Alright, let's go ahead and lay down our Zeo. You, you can use our Raikozan. Yukiko, you using our Diorama on you. And Naoto, you go for the Megado. And Yukari, you can just defend again. Go, 
Megado, do massive amounts of damage, please. 251, I will gladly take that. Rykozan, maybe we'll be able to keep the boost in effect this time. Never mind, that was wishful thinking. Ow. Alright then. Zio, we'll use Zionga this time. Yukiko, what do I want you to do? You can just guard. Naoto, you use Twin Slash and Yukari. He doesn't seem to be interested in attacking you, so you use the Heal Stone, Yukiko. Since we have infinite use of the Heal Stone. Which is very nice. Even if it's only 50 HP. No, I'll take it. Now the critical, which means assuming we can keep the boost, we're going to use another Megado next turn. Stab shower, I don't like the sound of that. Okay, this is not very good. Alright then, let's go ahead and use Zio. I am going to use Rikozan. Yukiko, you use Diorama. I'm not gonna lie, this isn't gonna this isn't going nearly as smoothly smoothly as my practice run. Uh we'll, and Kari you can just Medea. Megado, do another 212 damage. Zio. This guy's not doesn't have much HP left. Right, Kozan, hopefully we can survive because I need to give you some healing. Stab sure I don't like the sound of that. Yeah, thank god I got that off. Now I think everyone can survive this turn. Yep. Drama, please tell me. Oh no, I didn't put that in Minato. Oh boy. That's not good. We gotta lay down a healing breeze. Lay down our Chirunda. Kozan. We need heal Minato immediately. I mean immediately. Now that's how you can just use Megado regularly. And I want Minato to hopefully survive. We'll lay down a Trunda. Hopefully uh, this guy goes after you. Because if not, Minato is probably going down. Alright. Who's my swing? Okay, that could be that could be a lot worse, in all honesty. Diorama put Minato back on track. I think we're so close to finishing this fight that it's probably not worth it to just to power charge. How much HP do you have left? Yeah, I think we're just gonna go for the Zionga. Yukiko, you just attack. Naoto, you use Twin Slash. Kari, you use Garua. Out of here. And we're getting a Persona. Not bad at all. And it's a decently rare one. Get Pyrojack. I will gladly take Pyrojack. All right. You're so cool. My energy is getting low. Huh? You're joking, right? So, what do you think? We get the yellow orb. Thank goodness. All right then, let's head back to the nurse's office then. See what Elizabeth has to say. <laughs> nurse's office. Let's go. First, let's heal because. Well, we need healing. 
go and report. Investigate you in Wonderland. We've completed this. As I expected. If I were to put this in an analogy, I have decided. Okay then. This will be your. We get a merit badge. We'll check what that does in a bit. For now, well, we're also getting experience. Koromaru is learning Agilao, and he'll be learning Mudoan soon. Last request. Time for a warm up. Are you sure? Where you must fight Elizabeth. It's time for your persona check. I must drive you to new heights for the sake of my research. That is why I wish for you to have a bout. And win. Now, as for where we'll do this, may I borrow your map for a moment? Thank you. You may have it back now. Well, let's go ahead and mark that. Considering the times we live in, I've used disappearing ink. It's very eco friendly. Please note it down for yourself later. I scouted it earlier, and it's spacious enough to host our ballot. I ask that you fight me there. Since the power of bonds is part of your true strength, please feel free to bring your friends along. I will be waiting for you there. Alright. Let's go ahead and leave, and I'm going to go ahead and save once again, because this fight that we just had against the Golden Beetle did not go as smooth as the previous one. Who's to say this one will go as smoothly? Alright, let's go into the Labyrinth. Investigate the Group Date Cafe. And that does appear to be the third floor, I do believe. Because I did do a practice run of fighting Elizabeth as well. Alright, let's get down to business. Also, we are probably going to encounter an enemy on. Yep. I want to fight this. Let's be I'm kind of debating whether or not I want to fight it, but I think I'll fight this golden hand. Because I do want to stay in top form for when we fight Elizabeth. But I mean, experience is still nice to have. Might maybe be able to land a hit. I think we only did three hits in total. We need to land two more. Hopefully both of these twin slashes hit. Oh, that also works. Mess with one, get a critical with the other. And we're getting a persona. I also didn't make the decision that because we have persona fusion, which makes persona fusing so much easier, I'm gonna be adding persona stick compendium off screen. As opposed to on screen, because well, you have the persona fusion the uh, fusion search for at your disposal as well if you're playing this, so it shouldn't be necessary. So, stop two. Ah, oh, dang it. What do we have to fight this time? Or what do we have to run from this time? Because I'm not fighting these things. I still want to stay in top form for my bout with, with Elizabeth. Alright, we're now on the right floor. Group, group date cafe stop three. Here and here we are. What is this power? It feels really dangerous. Elizabeth seems strong. Please try not to get hurt. Oh, but I guess you could have her treat you if that happens. She does run the nurse's office after all. Isn't that kind of um what is it they say about interests? Um, it's in her best interests. That's it. Cool. 
You're so smart, Fuku-chan. Th that's not true. But is in her best interest right, though? I feel like it doesn't make much sense here. Uh, anyway, shall we fight Elizabeth now? Let's go inside. I think we should be able to take her on. I've been waiting for you. I've been so engrossed in my research that my joints have gotten all stiff. I can hear my bones cracking. To start off, I will fight you as if I'm warming up. Miss, why do we have to fight? Teddy, the answer is simple. Perhaps because this isn't Tartarus or the TV world, but you're all rather... somewhat pretty, absolutely, still on the path of growing stronger. You're weak, very, extremely, to the point that I have to do a double take. Oh my! That is why I'm overstepping my bounds to do you a solid. Please come at me with the best you have as of this moment. Ah, this lady isn't nice. We gotta teach her a lesson. Don't hold anything back, okay? Well then, here goes. Your fate is in the cards. All right, let's do this. Hello, Elizabeth. This persona and I shall be your opponents for this battle. Please demonstrate your power to me. I demand satisfaction. Go, everyone! All right, let's open this up with a healing breeze. And I'm going to go ahead and lower her attack. That would probably be the smartest idea. Uh, let's go ahead and use Power Charge. Yukiko, what can I have you do? Oh, you can just attack. Naoto, you use a Twin Slash. Yukari. Oh, you can also just physically attack. <laughs> yeah, that's a physical attack. Alright. Twin Flash, hopefully we can get a critical. Nope. That's alright. Power Charge will hopefully help us a decent amount, because I think we do have Swiss Strike on you, which will definitely do a lot of damage to Elizabeth. Three hits, plus considering the fact we have a Power Charge. That is definitely a decent amount of Ivor for her, it. Let's see. Where yeah, Swift Strike. I got worried for a second that my personas got mixed up. That would have been bad. Then use our Twin Slash and do that. Oh boy, here we go. Tempest Slash. Yeah, that hurts a bit. Ooh, a critical. That's, that was really good. That was amazing. Slash, maybe we'll get another critical. No. Alright then. Alright, let's also go ahead and lay down our healing breeze and our Tarunda. Make sure those stay in effect for longer. We'll take advantage of this and use power charge. Yukiko, you use Diorama. Naoto, Twin Slash. And Kari, you can just use a heal stone on you. That's giving me our plan of attack for this turn. Also, that still hurts. Especially since she's just beating us up with a book. Might I remind you? Heal stone, it's not much, but it's not consumable, so it should be fine. Alright, let's go ahead and use... Your toe. You. You can use an Iron Swift Strike. Yukiko, you use Heal Stone on Naoto. Naoto, you use Twin Slash, and Yukari. Because I... Oh, never mind. I can only use it once per turn. Car, you just attack then. Tempest Slash, I don't like the look of that. 
Okay, that wasn't that bad. Aw, uh, that was a pretty lame squish strike. Alright, Wind Slash. It's no use. Hit it! Here you go! We're all pretty much at full health now. Is this now. the extent of your power? Dainty though I am, I do have some knowledge of rough play. There is no need to hold back. Please approach me with the intent to kill. Your intel is our last use of power charge, so it better be worth it. Yukiko, you can just attack. Naoto, you use our twin. Actually, no. Naoto, you use Megado. And then Yukari, you just attack. Uh, paralysis, how I hate you. Megado, hopefully, this does a decent amount. 221, that's not bad. Uh huh? Okay, due to paralysis. I'm sad now. Alright then. Vice leader is still paralyzed. No, I can't. Alright, Gurinto, you. Yeah, power charge. Yukiko, you attack. Naoto, you go for the twin slash. Kari, you just attack. Here I go. swing, yeah, that still hurts quite a decent amount. Alright, hopefully we get a critical. That's pretty much just what I'm hoping for, is to get decent critical so that I can take advantage of boosts. Because the boosts are amazing. Alright then. Here in tow. Power charge. Attack. Twin slash. And heal stone on the Minato. Tempest slash? I do not like the look of that. Alright, twin slash. Critical, there's the critical I was looking for. We'll throw up a power charge. Hang in there. Alright, then. Now that's done. Alright, gear and tow. Swift strike. Attack. Megado and Heal Stone. Megado, you should do a decent amount. Andre H2. Finding Cry again. Oh, I want to hit four of us this time. That's not good. Alright, Swiss so Strike, make me proud. You made me more proud than you did last time. What the? Hang in there! Hit. Alright. Heal Stone. I have you for a reason. Oh, and Healing Breeze wore off too. And Tarunda wore off. Oh. For a brief instant, I felt as if I saw an oasis in the desert. However, the battle is not yet over. Take care not to exhaust yourself. Leader All right. Paralysis has a warning. Let's lay down our Healing Breeze and our Tarunda. You, you use Swift Strike because you can't use Power Charger anymore unless we get a boost. Yukiko, you attack, Naoto, Twin Slash, and Yukari, you use Heal Stone on you. We'll put Healing Breeze back into effect. Oh, you are using Turbukasha. Well, you know what I have to say to that? I can't move due to Paralysis. That's what I have to say about it. Oh, this was a terrible turn. All we got was, like, a 50 HP game. At least we lit... Okay. Of course, everyone heals from the paralysis, except for Minato, the person who I need to cast Tarunda. Of course. Fine. Also, this heal stone is a lot more useful than you would think. I just want to stay that out. My A swing, this is gonna hurt. Swiss strike, let's hope for a critical. Nope, two of them even miss. Alright, then. Ooh, another critical. 
so. I think what I'm going to want to do now is first lay down our healing breeze and use Tarunda again. You, you go for our swift strike. Yukiko, you use Diorama on you. Naoto will take advantage of that boost with, by using Megado and Yukari. You use a heal stone on Minato. They should put us back on track, theoretically. Tempest Slash, this is still gonna hurt a decent amount. Yeah, that hurt quite a bit. Only a little bit. This is why we have Tarunda as well. I'm just gonna state that now. Heal Stone. Drama, heal you. Alright then, what do we want to do now? We're going to use our Torundo to extend its effect. We're going to use Swift Strike. We now need to heal Minato. Let's use a Twin Slash. And Yukari, you can just attack. Binding Cry could be worse, but I still don't like that. Oh. Okay, it wasn't as bad as the last one. Yes! Critical hit. That is what I like to see. Here I go. That is exactly what I wanted to see. I could not have asked for anything better, pretty much. Now, you're in tow. Now I can use power charge again. Yukiko, you can just attack. Naoto, Twin Slash, and Yukari, you use a Heal Stone on Minato. Alright. Oh, really? Tarukaja? And I can't move due to process. Fan Bloody Task. Twin Slash is getting a critical. That is definitely good. Alright, how much longer are our effects going to stay in, in effect? As redundant as that makes sound. Elizabeth's at neutral. We still have a bunch of... You still got the power charge. We still have a healing breeze in effect for a few more turns. Let's go ahead and lay down our Tarunda. You. You use Swift Strike. Yukiko. You can just attack. Naoto. Megado. Kari. Why don't you use Garula this time? Might as well do a bit more damage. Megado is going to do us a decent amount. Elizabeth's now getting a bit. Swift Strike to use. Well, only 170. That sucks. Right, Garula, hopefully you'll do a decent amount. 109, that's not bad. <laughs> that is more like it. I shall shift into the corresponding gear. I hope that you enjoy this battle to its very end. Alright. Let's go and use Aguel to Swift Strike. I think we can kind of go all out now. I think she's weak enough to the point that we should be alright. Swift Strike's getting a critical. Awesome. That is good. Go ahead and use Aguilal. Deal more damage. Twin Slash. Not bad. Garua, do more damage. Aguilal. And that does it. <laughs> that was fun. Well, this episode went on for quite a while. Whew. Well done. I have indeed sent the latent power within you. It seems you still have quite a ways left to grow. I'm relieved to learn this. Your reward will be given to you in the nurse's office. Now then, I'll go on ahead.
Alright. Well, at least I know we got caught up on quests this episode, even though it is a long episode. Then again, most of these episodes have been a, a lot longer than usual. Which I'm kind of okay with. Alright. First, we need healing. Now, let's go ahead and report that request. Thank you for agreeing to my request. Here is your reward for this time. We get the Scarlet Brace. Having this in your possession will allow you to create a certain new persona through fusion. Please accept it. Perhaps it's because it's been a while since I last stretched myself like this. But I feel very good. I certainly wish to have another bout with you at some other time. Just as a means of recreation. Alright then, let's claim our experience. Mature is learning Bufala. And she'll be learning Mind Charge soon. Alright, well, I think that about does it for this episode. So, next time on Persona Q Shadow of the Labyrinth, we're going to be fighting the second boss. See you guys then.